and uh, welcome to the stage to talk about your ride and, uh, and so on. But first of all, let's talk a little bit about the, uh, the event and how it came about and, uh, and uh, your involvement with uh, the ride. Okay, well, so it came about actually kind of... Uh, it came about when uh, I read about the article in the paper, or read the article in the paper, it talked about 44 correctional officers being killed in Israel. Being a correctional officer myself, I automatically sort of zeroed in on it, and um, there was virtually no press coverage on it. And I mentioned to my husband, he said, well, we really should do something. 44 officers, it's going to involve families, it's going to involve what have you. So he got in touch with the JNF in Toronto, the Jewish National Fund, and it happened the executive director, Josh Cooper, is also a motorcycle enthusiast. The ride was born from there. Last year we did it for our first annual one. We had about 85 bikes registered. Uh, about 120, 125 riders came out. And we were able to raise $10,000 for the scholarship fund that we've established for the children of the correctional officers that were killed. There were 56 children left with them. That's amazing. That's an amazing cause and amazing. So who's the hard charger's motorcycle club? That's, that's our group, uh, the Heart Church Motorcycle Club. It's the first law enforcement correctional officer oriented club in Canada that we're aware of. Um, my husband, Dave McKinnon, who is the chapter president, was able to secure a charter from the Heart Chargers in the U.S. Uh, they started in, I believe, 2004 in New Hampshire. Uh, there's 30 chapters for the Heart Chargers in the U.S and they range from New Hampshire to Oregon. So that, how many members are in the chapter up here? There's 10 right now in our chapter, and we, as a matter of fact, got some info today from some correctional officers in Kingston who work at uh, Collins Bay Penitentiary. They want to open their own chapter down there. We met them here at the show, and they're that interested. They want to open their own chapter. Yeah, amazing. So we're growing as well. That's great. All right, so the correctional officers' ride is Sunday, August the 12th. It starts at the Rio Can Mall, which is at Highway 7 and 400 at 9 o'clock. Uh, riders $25, passengers 15 and where does it go? They haven't established this year's ride yet, although last year we went through Hawkley Valley. Uh, Forks of the credit, I, I didn't go. I had to stay back and do some administrative stuff. Yeah, isn't that a pain? I, I don't get to go on the ride either. I have to stay back and do the administrative stuff. Exactly. But I get to ride it before everybody else, so I do get to see it. Well, that's exactly it. Everybody did that. Uh, our ride captains laid out the uh, laid out the route. Everybody raved about not only the lovely ride, but the delicious lunch after, and uh, that was a good thing. Uh, we did have uh, silent auction. We had raffles, 50/50 draws, and we had a phenomenal turnout. We were just thrilled to death to see that we had done so well. And this year, with the uh, the publicity we're getting here at the show, we're hoping to, you know, do maybe twice what we did last year. Fantastic. All right, so the uh, correctional officer's ride is Sunday, August the 12th. Uh, put it in your calendar, a great cause, and it sounds like a great group of people to ride with. And uh, let's hope you have a great success. The weather holds for you, and uh, you get out there and uh, have some fun at the same time. Thanks for That's coming That's great. Up, Thank you, Steve. And uh, we do have our booth over in oh, Hall sorry, 1. Yeah. We'll so in hall uh, 1. we do have some videos. We have uh, some handouts. And we'd and love they, to talk to you over at Hall 1. You can sign up there and register. Yes. You can register Absolutely. online. we got an online website. Yes, we do. We have an online website. We do donations as well. Very good. All right. So again, the Correctional Officers Ride, Sunday, August the 12th, 2012. Check them out over in Hall 1. Visit with them and, uh, and sign up for the ride. Thanks very much, Jim. Thank you, Steve. Appreciate it.